Well, hey, hey, and welcome to the first ever episode of the Brand Builder Diaries. Now, if you're a regular to the channel, you'll know a few weeks ago I talked about how ultimately in recent times I kind of just lost my way a little bit and hadn't grown our own e-commerce brands in the way that I would like and in the way that I would like you to do either. And so we decided to do something a little bit crazy and completely start again, build a brand from the very ground up and ultimately show you the whole journey Two, we recently ran something that we called the Brand Builder Challenge. Now, this was like a seven day live challenge experience where every day we'd jump on live, share something pertinent to growing a successful brand, and people could ask questions, get feedback, and so on. And honestly, it was one of the best things we've ever done. There was so much engagement, and I know so many of you got so much out of it. Uh, by the way, if you didn't join us for the last one, make sure you do keep an eye out for the next one because we will run it again in the not too distant future. But inside the challenge, I revealed the identity of this new brand that we've been laying some foundations on and uh, it was exciting to hear people's feedback excited to see how people were excited to follow along the journey and so we wanted to kind of try and bring a taste of that to YouTube as well on a more regular ongoing basis now we've been super busy uh, working with that community for the last few weeks but now things are a little bit less crazy just really trying to make time to start making these episode format videos for you and, uh, and to be able to document the process of building this brand really from day Day one all the way to uh, wherever it goes right who knows and so yeah excited to bring you on the journey I suppose this this whole journey started for me maybe around about a year ago just this change slight change in the way I've been thinking and, and what I want to do the direction I want to go and with, with all of our businesses really and it was all seeded by reading this book called shoe dog by Phil Knight if you haven't read it yet then as the commu our community would know, I, like, I highly suggest reading it. It's one of the best books you could read about building a brand. Like You shouldn't read it if you want to build an easy business that's convenient, that's just going to make you loads of money overnight because it's it's an incredibly challenging journey that Phil Knight talks about on, on the journey of building the brand Nike. 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 Now it's, it's so good that I'll probably do a book review about it soon because I've been rereading it recently and uh, and yeah, I think it deserves its own book review because it's got so much in it that's really, really helpful. But at the end of the book, he, he talks about his time with Nike and about what they tried to build and the kind of the journey, the mindset he went on. And like I say, around about a year ago, it really began to shift some things in me about how I was thinking about the different businesses we're running. And I felt like I wanted to kind of read you that quote just at the beginning of this journey, just to talk about, like I say, the, the motivation behind this and I suppose what we're trying to do with it. He, he said this at the end of the book. He said, I redefined winning and expanded it beyond my original definition of not losing, of merely staying alive. That was no longer enough to sustain me or my company. We wanted, as all great businesses do, to create, to contribute, and we dared to say so aloud. When you make something, when you improve something, when you deliver something, when you add some new thing or service to the lives of strangers, making them happier or healthier or safer or better, and when you do it all crisply and efficiently, smartly, the way everything should be done but so seldom is, you're participating more fully in the whole grand human drama. More than simply alive, you're helping others to live more fully. And if that's business all right, call me a businessman. It's amazing, right? These words that he uses, you're participating more fully in the whole grand human drama. You know, you want to be more than simply alive. You want to help others to live more fully. And I, it kind of made me begin to assess what we were doing with, with our brands and, and all of our businesses. Like, are we, are we serving people? Are we helping people participate in this whole grand human drama? Or are we just trying to make money? Because ultimately, if, if all we're do, trying to do is make money, if all we're trying to do is just sell products on Amazon, then there's a limited shelf life to that. The challenges that can come, the problems that can come up, the things that can put us off. But when we commit to building a coherent brand that serves a group of customers, a certain set of people, and we build some structure and longevity around that, then uh, me personally, I feel way more passionate about that. And so we kind of assessed everything we're doing, made some crazy kind of decisions that we were going to strip back a lot we were of what we were doing, start afresh, a, a completely new brand, and uh, and really kind of, uh, you know, invest a lot into it and build something that we knew that we weren't just selling products, but that we were actually serving 
people and ultimately that's the journey we're on like for me i own an education company it would, it would be easier and we'd make more revenue and more money if i just sold a dream and told everybody how easy this was but i, I don't want to just tell you how easy something is i want to show you the reality of the journey this is hard work this is uh, you know you need to get your hands dirty this is going to take some time and effort and energy but if you commit to this process of building something real not just copy paste off Ali and Baba and hope for some traffic off amazon but actually build a, a real business with with real customers with real traffic with real assets all this kind of stuff then uh, then something amazing can happen and that's the journey we're going on and that's the journey we want to take you on with brand builder diaries and so what will that look like well we're going to bring a weekly episode every single week taking you behind the scenes on our brand we're not just going to tell you what's happening but we're going to show you what's happening we're going to show you behind the scenes of this brand you'll see the identity of the brand you'll see the products you'll see how we're launching them why we're launching them how we're growing our audiences how we're growing assets within the business how we're generating more traffic how we're building websites how we're building all this kind of stuff that comes together how how you can you know really grow these in your businesses too each month i'm going to do uh, like an income report so i'm going to show you what the brand has generated in revenue what we've spent what our profit margins are why we've made the decisions to invest in what we have while we're ordering different products all of that kind of stuff i'm going to document as much as i can in a short weekly episode for you to keep you updated they're going to be somewhat more like I don't want to say vlog style because that's a bit pretentious, but I'm going to try and include just a little bit more of day-to-day -day life, not just necessarily me sitting here talking to a camera, but, you know, include the things we're up to day-to-day, -to -day, take you on the journey, and hopefully make it a super interesting experience for you. Where we're at right now is that we have laid the foundations for the brand. We've registered the trademark. We have set up a website. We've started to build an audience. We're working with suppliers on products. We've got three products that are just kind of coming to completion of production right now and are due to go on sale around January so uh, we're going to take you along the ride for, for that whole process um, because we have sort of laid some of that groundwork what I'm going to do over the next few weeks is kind of catch you up on that journey talk you through about our mentality for choosing the products we have our thought process for how we're going to launch them while we're building an audience up front and how we've done that going to talk you through uh, how what our experiences were working with uh, a sourcing agent for one of our products and uh, you know a few different things like that to catch you up and in about four to five episodes episodes time you will have caught up with where we're at real time you kind of see us launching the products and uh, see a whole bunch of stuff exciting stuff going on there and like i say each week document where we're at what's happening and why we're doing it so that it can hopefully help you how can you follow the journey well of course number one be subscribed with notifications on on youtube because we'll be dropping a new video every single week but also you can follow me on social media uh, i'll leave links down below for my instagram and my twitter account which i've been a little bit quiet on recently because because we've been busy just working with our community but I'm going to try and sort of document the journey a little bit more on both Instagram and Twitter two platforms that I really enjoy and uh, they're just my personal accounts right there's not I don't have like a personal account and a business account uh, in my name and uh, in my business account just kind of spam you with course results and testimonials and you know we, we set, we'll celebrate some stories along the way but uh, but ultimately it's it's my my life you know you'll be following along the journey of someone who's actually doing this who's actually building a brand so hopefully you find that helpful it's there if you want it and then finally the the final thing you can do to follow along is join the brand builder society now this is like our free community it's a free facebook group that you can join and interact uh, if you do have any questions each week in the episodes you can definitely drop them in the comments below and i will get back to you but if you want to go deeper if you want to sort of access some free introductory trainings into what it means to grow a brand, how you build a website, how you reach new audiences, how you build an email list, how you sell products, launch products, and so on, there'll be introductory trainings inside that group for you. So you can join that at any time, join the conversation there, get our support along the way, and we'd love to help you with that. So you can subscribe, you can join me on social media, or you can join us in the society. Those are three ways you can follow this journey. This is uh, episode one of uh, however many episodes who knows where we're going to take this brand builder journey but I know for one I am excited about the journey in next week's episode I'll talk to you all about the decisions we've made in the early stages of this business why we've made them why we're taking the approach we are and how they might apply to your business so make sure you're subscribed with notifications on ready for episode two coming out here on Monday okay take care and I will see you guys real soon